Homeschool Kids, it's Miss Brittany. And I'm Mr. Evan. We're so glad you're watching with us today. We've got Haley and Sophia here with us to help tell our Bible story too. I know it's a little weird, but we're doing Bible school from our living room. This is Haley, and she is going to be our royal leader today and help us tell our Bible story. Today we're going to learn that God wants to help you and me. So I've got a special saying to help us remember all about our Bible story. God, God helps, helps me, me. Take it away, Haley. There's a story in the Bible about a queen who needed God to help her. Let's have a listen. This is Esther. Esther was one of God's people. She lived with her cousin Mordecai. The two of them loved God very much. If you love God very much, give yourself a big hug. When Esther grew up, the king of her land chose her to be the queen. She got to live in the palace, dress up, and wear fancy jewelry. Esther was very happy living in the castle and being the queen. But the king had a helper in his palace named Haman. Haman did not love God or God's people. He tricked the king into making a new rule that would get rid of all of God's people. Mordecai heard about the new rule and rushed to tell Queen Esther what Haman had done. He told her that this new rule would mean that they all would be killed, including Queen Esther and Mordecai. When Esther heard what was happening, she knew she needed to talk to the king. But there was a problem. If King Xerxes didn't ask you to come speak to him and you just showed up, you could get in big trouble. Queen Esther knew she needed help, God's help. So Esther asked Mordecai and all of God's people to pray for God to help her be brave and talk to the king. God helped Queen Esther talk to the king and she told him all about Haman's plan to kill God's people, including her. The king could not believe what Haman had done. He had Haman taken away for good. Now chosen and special people were safe. Yay! You are special too. He is always with you and ready to help you. Let me hear you say this after me. God, God helps, helps me. Me. Very good, guys. Thanks for helping share our Bible story this week. We're going to look at our Bible memory verse now. Our Bible memory verse says, You are God's chosen and special people. 1 Peter 2, 9. Miss Brittany's going to teach you guys some motions to help you remember. First, we're going to point out and say, You are. You, you are. are. Next, we're going to point up and say, God's chosen. God's Us chosen. Then we're going to give a thumbs up and say, And special people. And special people. Last, we're going to look in our Bible and say, 1 Peter 2 9. 1 Peter 2 9. All right, so let's try it together. You are, you are, God's chosen, God's chosen, and special people, and special people. First Peter, first Peter, two nine, two nine. That was a little tricky, so let's try it one more time. We're gonna point out first. Say, you are, you are. Point up. God's chosen, God's chosen, and special people, and special people. First Peter, First Peter, two nine, two nine. Very good. We're so happy that we got to share our Bible story with you today. We sure did miss seeing all your smiling faces, though. So when you're feeling scared or nervous this week, and you're worried if God's gonna help you, just remember our special saying: God, God. Helps. Helps. Me. Me. All right. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye.